students. If you're not my student, welcome. If you are my student, welcome. Um, so in this video, I am going to show you how to create a mind map that reflects the organization of your note cards in your old school analog Zettelkasten system. The app that I'm going to ask you all to use to create that mind map is called Miro. So in order to get that app, you should go to the Miro website and click on sign up for free. And it asks for your work email. I would just recommend that you log in using your school email account. Once you have signed up for a free Miro account, you're gonna be able to make, I think, up to three editable, editable boards. You're gonna to need to make just a single mind map. So you'll use just a single board, as they're called in Miro. Now, if you want all the features that Miro has to offer, you should use Miro in its web-based form. Um, you don't have to do that. Um, especially for the purposes of creating a simple mind map, you certainly do not all need access to all of Miro's features. So if you want to use the desktop version, laptop version, um, tablet version, phone version, it should be fine. Uh, and you can get access to those on the Miro website. So I'm using Miro in the web browser right now. This is a Safari browser. So to create your mind map, simply go here and click on add a mind map. Then over here, we're not going to use this stuff, at least not now we're not. So if you click on this and it gets highlighted with this rectangle, you can hit the delete or maybe the backspace key and that will delete that branch. And then let's click on this one as well until you see that blue rectangle there. I'm going to hit delete again so we don't need any of those. And then the first branch that we're going to create is the one for the examined life. I think that was just the number one. The examined life. The next one to type is 1.1 philosophy. And then to create a new node after this one, just click on this plus sign. And the next category, or what I had in class called a folder card, is the one titled uh, Definitions of Philosophy. Then hit the plus button again. And this is finally where we got to what I referred to as an idea card. And so this one is, the number for this one is 1.1.1-1. .1 .1 and the title of this one was Philosophy Equals Thinking About Thinking. And just so you know, as I'm, I'm scrolling around here, I'm using a trackpad on my laptop, and with two fingers I can just move around. Um, if you're using a mouse, I think you want to be right-clicking and then, yeah, right-clicking, and then you should be able to, to move the canvas around the same way you see me doing here with the trackpad. Now, after this card that we had created in class, after philosophy equals thinking about thinking, was the card that contains uh, Dewey's definition of philosophy, or at least a passage where he identifies philosophy with what he calls criticism. So I'm going to hit the plus button again, and I'm going to do 1.1.1-1A because I see this card as a continuation in some sense of the card that is titled Philosophy Equals Thinking About Thinking. So this one, the title of this one was Philosophy Equals Criticism. I'm going to hit the tab key here and that's going to give me a new note, I think. Yep. So you don't always have to use the, the mouse to click on the, the plus sign. So branching off from this one were two notes. The first, the number of it is 1.1.1-1. 1. 1. 1. 1 a 1. And this one, the title of it was Influential Beliefs That Should Be Challenged. And then the card 
that we did after this one, it's going to go underneath here. So you have, I think, a couple options here. I think I'm going to try this. I think I can just hit the return key. Yes. So if you hit the return key from a node, then it's going to uh, create, I think, what's called a sibling node. Um, if we were over here in this node, philosophy equals criticism, we could hit the plus button. This is going to create a third branch, so I'm going to delete it right after. But you hit the plus button. That's another way that you can create a, a sub branch. But again, I'm going to delete that one as soon as it gives me the option to do so. Okay, I might as well delete this over here because we are not using this quite yet. So the other card is 1.1.1-1A2. And this was the one titled, Why We Need Philosophy. Don't really like the way, I don't know why that's, uh, I don't know why that is straight and this one is bendy. Uh, maybe it's because I had created that third branch. I'm gonna cut this, put it here, see if this helps at all. No, yeah, that helped a little bit. I might be able to move this a little bit. Yeah, so I can manually move this. So that, and here I'm gonna pinch zoom, I think, so you can see the whole thing. Yeah, we don't need this over here. We're not using this quite yet. We'll eventually branch off. We'll have other branches um, from the examine life. But this is basically what your mind map that reflects your analog Zettelkasten. and this is what it should look like based on the cards that we have created together in class. Pretty quickly, your mind map is going to, yes, it's going to continue to have these cards in it, uh, but pretty soon it is going to diverge significantly from the Zettelkasten mind maps that you're going to see your fellow students creating. So once you have done this, you're close to being done with the assignment. The next thing to do is to get a link to this board or the web URL for this board. And to do that, you go back to your uh, home page or whatever it's called here, and you find the board that you want to send, and it's this one here. Click the three dots and then click this to copy the board link and then you will take that link and paste it into where you're supposed to submit the assignment in Canvas. And that's it. I hope that was pretty straightforward. I know you cannot wait to continue working on your old school Zettelkasten. Not just my students, but anyone else who might be watching this video. Hit subscribe or something like that. It's what you're supposed to do on YouTube. Out of here.